guys, so I thought it was about time that I did something Christmassy, and so I decided on a tag. I found the Christmas tag and the Holly Jolly tag, and I decided that since the Christmas tag is so small, I'd combine the two because I have nothing better to do with my life than answer heaps and heaps of just questions about Christmas. So, um, here we go. Oh, also before I start, um, yes, I cut my hair. Right now, it probably doesn't look as good as it possibly could because it's curly and I haven't straightened it, but it's there and I really like it and I'm quite happy with it. It's just got, I don't know if you can see on camera, but it's got like lighter ends slightly and then it goes darker up top and stuff. So it's, it's a balayage, really a gradient. So yeah, just in case you're wondering. Okay, so first question. Uh, for the holidays this year, I have like a three day Christmas, which is really, really cool for me. On the 23rd, I have Christmas Eve Eve at my boyfriend's house with his family and we're doing like, you know, presents and food and stuff that day. And then um, on Christmas Eve, I'm at my dad's parents' house, so my dad's, my grandparents on my father's side. And we do that every year and we just do the presents and lunch and dinner and it's just this whole big thing and then we pretty much do the exact same thing on Christmas Day with my mother's side of the family um, and it tends to change whose house it's at. This year it's at my uncle's house and so we'll do the presents and the food and everything and I think that's just for lunch and I think on Christmas Eve, I mean you know, the, the night of Christmas Day yeah, um, I think I'm going back around to my boyfriend's house and stuff and just saying fun. Um, yeah, I think that's, those are my plans. And then shopping on Boxing Day, obviously, a bit. Look, I live in Australia and we don't really have holiday drinks as such. I don't know, so I, I can't really answer that question. So I don't really know what a holiday drink is. I've never had eggnog, or like, because when, uh, Christmas is in summer here rather than winter. We don't really tend to have like hot chocolate or anything like that. I probably have to say gingerbread man just because I hardly ever get to have gingerbread men and I have candy canes all the time. We just have like this limited, limitless supply at my house over Christmas. It's actually ridiculous. They have for I've never seen snow before. Um, in the area of Australia that I live in, it doesn't snow. And it's also summer this time of year, so... Okay, this question was, what's your favourite winter fragrance? But it doesn't really make sense, so I changed it to favourite holiday season fragrance. I really like Lola by Marc Jacobs because it's... I don't know, I got it given to me for Christmas, so I kind of just associate it around with Christmas time and it just reminds me of Christmas, that's really why. It's gonna be Elf. Who are like actually you know what? I really like Home Alone as well. And of course the Grinch. The Grinch is a good one. I think that's all awesome. Naughty or nice. Um look, I probably have to say somewhere in the middle. I'm I, I would want to say that I'm leaning more towards the nice side rather than the naughty side. So. Uh, embarrassing. Okay, my sister and I get our photo taken with Santa Claus every year and none of them are really too embarrassing but I'll show you this year. This is this year's Christmas photo with Santa Claus. He kind of just like dragged me onto his lap and that was kind of awkward in itself but yeah that's Christmas photo from this year. Right um, well, considering I spend Christmas Eve at my dad's parents' house, then yeah, no, I do open presents on Christmas Eve, and I think it's always nice to do that anyway. I think it's nice to like drag out Christmas for as long as it can go. Um, oh. Donna, dancer, prancer, vixen. Dasher and Dancer and Donna and Blitzen and Rudolph and I think that's 
Oh god, how many are there? Is there nine? I don't even know. If there's nine, then I got them all. I can't remember if I like renamed any of them or not, but I, I think I just did it. I don't know. Um, oh, no, because it's like Comet and Cupid. And. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> and Rudolph as well, obviously. I think that's all of them. Look, I always love the Pavlova on Christmas um, at my mum's family's house. It's so, it's just so Australian, which is ridiculous because I'm not Australian. Like, my dad's Portuguese, my mum's Greek. I have nothing Australian about me, but we have a Pavlova. It's ridiculous. Uh, my Christmas tree is fake because uh, a couple of years ago we had a real one and I get like chronic hay fever and so I was just sneezing and we had like spiders and earwigs everywhere and it was just not a nice experience so we decided not to do that again. Oh uh, god. Look, I love Christmas Day with my mum's side of the family because my uncle, he's not a chef, but he is an amazing cook and the food is always so good. Um, usually we have, they're not really a, oh, they're not a Christmas treat, but my uncle does these really, really nice, and my mum as well, does these really, really nice, um, like Spanish puff pastry little triangles thingies and it's got like cheese and stuff in it and it's just so good. Um, I'm trying to think of something Christmassy though. We don't really do the puddings or anything like that. Like we, other than a pavlova, we really don't have any other like Australian food. Um, we do like, my grandmother on my dad's side um, does like turkey and like roast pork and stuff like that so I guess that would probably be my favourite, other than the pavlova of course, which I mentioned before. <laughs> Giving gifts freaks me out. I don't, like, don't get me wrong, I don't mind spending money on people. That's fine, as long as they have told me what to get them. But if I have to, like, take initiative and be like, hmm, what would this person like as a gift? I freak out, I'm done, like, because I want people to like what I get them. Like, I don't want them to look at it and go, hmm. So, I really freak out, so I prefer receiving gifts because I don't have to panic about them. Like, if they're bad, I just pretend, and I pretend really well that I like them. Um, because I know how much it sucks giving somebody a present that they don't like. Angel at your door. Um, I don't really have any tacky Christmas attire. Like, I've never had the sweaters because I don't, like, it's warm here, and where would I have a Christmas sweater? I've guessed it'd probably be, like, these little badges and stuff, and I have some like light up earrings somewhere, um, but other than that, there's nothing really tacky that I, oh, there's nothing really tacky that I have, which is nice. But you can leave somewhere like where it's snowing, um, that would be really great. Holiday recipe that I like to help, look, I'm a bad cook. You don't want me in the kitchen. You don't want me to help you do anything in the kitchen. I'm bad. I just like, last time I tried to make a cake, it exploded in the oven because I put like dishwashing powder in it instead of like, powder, like a, I don't know, flour or something. It was not like, I'm not, I'm not good at cooking. You don't want me in the kitchen. So there's nothing really that I like to help with. I love wrapping presents. It's like one of my favorite things to do at Christmas time. I just like, I'm, I actually pride myself upon my present wrapping ability. It's not a vacancy. I don't have a single favorite holiday moment as such, but I love putting up the Christmas tree every year. I just love it. It doesn't matter like if I'm doing it by myself or like with my whole family or it's just like a really nice thing to do. Um, I realized the truth about Santa, the truth about Santa, probably when uh, I've noticed that Santa was using the same wrapping paper as mum and dad. I do make New Year's resolutions. I rarely stick to them, although um, 
my New Year's resolutions. I'll make a video on my New Year's resolutions later on and um, yeah, we'll see if I stick to them year round. I really love the good times about the holidays, you know, like spending time with like friends and family and having like a good time with them and I I'm a big fan of like everything that is Christmas. Christmas has to be my favourite holiday, like of all time. Um, like Christmas, New Year's typey thing. Um, yeah, I just love everything about Christmas. And yeah, I don't really have much more to say about that. There's nothing like that stands out for me. It's kind of just everything that makes up Christmas makes it feel as good as it is for me. So yeah. And that's it guys, I hope that wasn't too boring or anything for you. It was kind of just like, it was time that I did something Christmassy and this is what I decided to do. Um, I've done stuff, Christmassy stuff on my um, blog. I did like a Christmas wish list and Christmas suggestions and stuff like that. So if you want to head to my blog, uh, which is um, bonvivance.blogspot.com um, you can head there, the website will be like, next, um, in, like the kind of credits-y thing that I do at the end, and it'll be in the down bar below, and um, yeah, so you guys can check it out if you like, and I'll talk to you guys soon, have happy holidays.